Spanish Town organizers are advancing plans to roll their parade through the streets of Baton Rouge, but the COVID-19 pandemic could change that. NBC Local 33's Abby Rocha has the story. Seeing these images from 2019 seems surreal as the COVID-19 pandemic continues. Spanish Town festivities in 2021 are up in the air right now, but planning is still underway. We're fairly confident now as, as everything is progressing that we're going to be able to have the parade. Board members say they need a final answer from city and state officials by the end of the year. People like to get the crews together like August, September, start working on costumes and who's riding and working on their float and they don't like to be put off to the last minute. They say they want to give the people what they want. They've been cooped up. They've been told you can't do this, you can't do that. They, they want out. They want to have some fun. You walk away from it and say, man, that was fun. And we need that in this country. We need that in Louisiana. The Raising Cane Center is booked for the Spanish Town Ball, and there are plans for different capacity options. We made plans for 25, 33, 50 percent. We'll lose money at 25, but we'll make it at 33, 50. Not a lot, but we'll, it'll get people in and get them to enjoy life. Board members say it's more than a fun time. The event supports local businesses and charities. Every year we donate approximately $90,000 to local charities. And there's a number of charities while they don't absolutely have to have our little bit of money that we give them, they depend on it. The governor stands by his statement that he released in September, saying in part that it would be purely speculative to say we know what Mardi Gras will look like next year. Abby Rocha, NBC Local 33 News. And the Royal Court for next year's Spanish Town Parade will be picked next month.